ya dad umeamka wewe ndio of course nimeamka kupuka vile your mom used to say wake up an hour early leave an hour man so ironic is not ironic you know you millennials will miss out on your lives all because of sleep yeah nikulalala na tu unataka hapa sasa dadu nataka mtu amke boy kila siku ya ni cover do let me tell you something eh? and, you, and you can take this to the bank for free mm-hmm. early morning is a new beginning always remember that okay Then you um ne ne me kwa kwa msema pema hivi because na jo this is not your normal waking time. Feel the kila kitu kokoa. Everything is fine. Um nilikuwa tu najipanga kwenda and I thought nikupigie as I wait. Kwa ni ulipata kazi na uniambi. Kazi gani? Your daughter is jobless kabisa. But anyway, how's how's Ian? Nilikuwa nimempigia jana ama juzi kaniambia uko na some school performance next week. Eh, mimi nakwambia Ian sana sasa this whole week about his performance. I I had to chase him away so that I can breathe. Ngoja, sasa ulimfukuza kaenda wapi? Ako ako ko kwa anti yake kete na watu wengi walikuja for midterm and I wanted to go spend some time at least before I reach Shule. Oh, oh, okay. Mm. But how are you kwa nini? Ukwa headache. Oh, to you sumbua sijui kama ticket sasa yana breathe, guy. Let her do you the malikwa zos. But hey, no one even warned me last holiday and the way they almost killed me. I'm too young for this old. I'm too young. I'm too young. <laughs> Hadi tu ya James Kiyo before guy yeah I um and as I come back ile story of Lani at the little bird in the burning forest uh that that old story your mom loved telling you eh eh unaza niambia that's that's a weird request coming from you especially at this hour Um uh, I just want to quiz the two one in time. Yeah, uh, is in the best time here, but when you come home I'll definitely tell it to you, okay? Dad. Dad. Kikwambia mtu story asubuhi 5 a.m. ni kitu ya kukataa kufanyia mtu shughuli. Bye bye days is you can enjoy. I promise I'll tell it to you kikuja. I'll tell it to you. It will actually really make my day please so, uh, i have a see uh, once they lived animals that used eh, eh, to that that uh, answer a long time ago come on mom <laughs> you done it and that was your story for humans from the earth the animal kingdom thrived as they coexisted in harmony with each other and with nature they shared resources and looked out for each other as a society until their fiercest enemy attacked an enemy that destroyed everything it touched an enemy so warm so tender one that destroyed everything no no the world is on fire and there's nothing we can do <laughs> uh, you your mom really loved my life me the queen and his two a guy ah to tendele tendele there was this little tiny hummingbird it would fly to the street carry as much water as it could in her feathers, fly back quickly and shake its little body vigorously, splashing the little water it had onto the mighty fire. The other animals looked at this little bird wondering what the hell it was doing. They asked the bird, why do you bother, surely? 
a tiny little bird like you is not much for a fire that consumes kingdoms. Why don't you stop? You know, the bird replied, at least I'm doing something about it. I am the change. That little bird's bravery inspired the others to join in and fight the fire. Um, Akuna, everything is fine. Don't get to. Those are definitely screams. What's happening, Uko? Ten minutes, get to Zako. Akuna, get to trust me. You story is charge. The the animals join in to fight the fire, and they win. Yes, they they won. They saved their kingdom. They are home. But none of them survived. They all died in the fire dump. There's something wrong in the land. That Nataka only skewed it, so. Nataka. Are you safe? That Nico Sawa. Now take her to the skills. Now to Mimi, I told you. 